uh, TLDR, and I do think that would be done, you know, well, I would probably, I do think I would get a lot of time, all the lowers, but I did respect that the DC is a block team. And I finished the VMark, you know, highlights in, in blockchain performance. Uh, certain networks gain popularity and development recognition, outperforming rivals in aspects like Google searches, NFT sales, and on-chain trading volume. Uh, cryptocurrency value fluctuations. There were notable increases in the prices of some cryptocurrencies, influenced by factors like TVL dynamics and market trends, while the direct correlation between TVL and price is not always clear. And according to Coin98 Analytics, the blockchain platform with the highest total value Locked as of the end of 2023 is Tron out of six million over eight billion dollars, BNB Chain and uh, Arbitrum 2.4 billion dollars rounded up the top three list, while Solana comes next with 1.4 billion. The analysis excludes Ethereum, whose figure reached almost 30 billion. Uh, however, the current standings have not always been the case. The three leading platforms retain their positions for the entire year although BNB Chain was first at the beginning, whereas Tron came second. And Solana was at the bottom in January 2023 with a TVL of $210 million. As the year passed, new blockchain networks emerged and shifted the landscape. One example of Coinbase's Layer 2 solution, BASE, which saw the light of day in August. Its TVL gradually increased throughout 2023 reaching almost $440 million by the end. Uh, for its part, Blast, uh, an upcoming L2 blockchain, made waves in the industry in the final quarter, uh, positioning itself uh, among the readers and finishing the year in the fifth spot um, with a TDL of over a billion. Uh, the rising popularity of the network led to a uh, phishing attack uh, in, in November, uh, following which uh, a victim uh, parted with the victim uh, uh, more than $130,000. Um, last mainnet launch uh, is uh, scheduled uh, for February this year. Um, um, Optimism, Avalanche, Polygon, and Cardano are the remaining blockchains from the top 10. Cardano started the year with less than $50 million and crossed the finish line at above $400 million. Uh, at the end of 2023, uh, besides Ethereum, um, here are the top 10 blockchains with the highest TVL. Um, the, uh, Tron, BNB, Chain, Arbitrum, Solana, Blast, Optimism, uh, Avalanche, Polygon, Base, Cardano, uh, and Point Nine Eight Analytics, December 31st, 2023. Uh, some cryptocurrencies, including Solana's Sol and Cardano's ADA, have charted notable price increases last year. The former surged from less than $10 to almost $125 by Christmas, whereas the latter experienced the 150% surge to above 60 cents. And uh, don't have the identified so far, uh, there's a new TV lock and there's a Nolan spike, but I kind of, there's no relationship in the commitment and uh, inacerbated uh, they're, they're deposited in a particular DeFi protocol and uh, might be considered a sign of trust and, and stability in the relevant network. Uh, uh, on the other hand, uh, rising TVL could be uh, a result of the bull market. Uh, in, in this case, uh, new funds uh, do not enter the ecosystem, but the value of the locked assets um, uh, heads north uh, as prices do so too. Uh, ecosystems and those two networks have been particularly intriguing to industry participants lately due to their achievements toward the year's end. Solana surpassed Ethereum regarding Google searches in mid-December, becoming more popular in countries like Spain and the Philippines. It outpaced its rival on the non-fungible token field too. Its NFT sales volume exploded to $75 million on a weekly basis last month versus $72 for Ethereum. Additionally, just Solana's on-chain trading volume peaked above $2.6 billion on December 22nd, while Ethereum recorded $1.6 billion on that day. And for its part, Cardano was highlighted as the top network by development activity in the last 30 days. This happened at the end of December with Polkadot 
Kusama, and Avalanche next in line.